Hi, my name is Sydney Thompson, and I'm the head manager of this Proactive Marketing location. Recently, our company has received many applications for our summer internships. Out of all the applications we received, we selected three individuals to come in and do a test day on the job to help us decide which one is the best fit for our company. My assistant manager, Emma Rose, will be handling the on-the-job training and will report to me at the end of each day with her notes on the candidates. If you have any questions, just let me know. Sweet. Sound good? Awesome. Thank you. All right. Thanks. about this office having a lot of yelling, so I'm gonna have you come with me to see my boss. So let's go. Today we had Mariana come into the office for her on-the-job test run. Emma instructed her to make sales calls to our customers, but unfortunately she was unsuccessful at her task. She not only did not know what she was doing, but she had no desire to do the work at all. Instead of doing the job assigned to her, she was on social media and ordering pizza. Based on what Emma told me, she doesn't seem to be a great fit for our company, and hopefully tomorrow's candidate will do a better job. Hi, Mauricio. So you're a marketing major, so today we're going to ask you to think of a strategy, whether for Snapchat or Instagram. Um, we have some events coming up, we want to get some ideas. So you can write them out on the notepad or do some research, whatever you want to do. Um, if you have any questions, I'll be in my office. Today we had Mauricio come in for his on-the-job test run. Emma instructed him to develop a marketing strategy for some of our company's upcoming events, but unfortunately he was unsuccessful at his job as well. Based on his coursework, he clearly understands how to do the job, but just wasn't interested in doing the work. Instead of doing the job assigned to him, he was watching videos online and goofing around. Based on what Emma told me, he doesn't seem to be a great fit for our company either, but hopefully our last candidate tomorrow will do a better job. We had our last candidate, Killian, come into the office for his on-the-job test run. Emma instructed him to analyze some data on Excel for our company to review, but unfortunately he was also unsuccessful at his job. Based on his resume, he was supposed to be proficient in Excel, but it didn't appear to be that way. Even though he didn't fully understand the job given to him, he did want to succeed and went to Emma to ask for help. Based on what Emma told me, he seems to be the best fit for our company, but we are going to review all the information before we provide any of the candidates an offer. All right, thank you all for coming in today on such short notice. I understand you had a few tough days on the job from what Emma's told me. Unfortunately, she's sick and cannot be here today, so I'm going to be doing your post-job interviews with you. So based on the notes she left me, you guys didn't really do that well. So Emma told me that we had one person lying on the resume, the other was live streaming on Instagram and ordering a pizza, and the other was watching LeBron James videos and shooting hoops with paper. So that's not really what we want for our job here. So I'm just going to let you know, it's probably not going to work out, but I would check your email for the next 48 hours to see if you've been hired. So you're free to go and I'll let you know what we think. Hi 
Killian, thank you for coming in on such short notice. I just wanted to say that out of all of the people that we were considering hiring, we'd love to hire you for the job. We were very interested in your enthusiasm for the company and learning more about the company. We understand that you did lie on your resume and you're not actually proficient in Excel, but honestly, that doesn't really matter to us as long as you're willing to learn. So we would love to teach you the skills you need and be able to have you in our company. Yeah, and out of all the candidates I saw, you were the only one that came to ask for help, which is really nice to see, and we're happy to have you at our company. So we'd love to hire you, and congratulations. Thank you Thank so you. much for coming in. We'll see you next week. Thank you.